the northern part of the peninsula is a little bit more stable than the south. There is, there is, uh, the north is actually between two plates, you know, the, the Eurasian plate, which is more stable, and the, uh, uh, the plate, you know, is actually, you know, where the mountains are. That one is a little bit more unstable. And it's an area that actually has earthquakes at time to time. Uh, the last earthquake, like that like destructive earthquake, was the Yalta earthquake of 1927, I believe, it's, um, which actually destroyed not only Yalta but in other places, right? And and there are also earthquakes mentioned, you know, in the in I mean in historical times before then. So it's an area that is active, but it, it's pra- practically only you know the south, the the, the mountain. There are faults there. You know, and, and 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 it's a totally different terrain from the one in the in the north. In the north, you don't have that. I mean, you have still tectonic movements, particularly you know the sinking, but but it's not something that you know is is um, it's like other parts of the world, like in the Caucasus or or places like Italy, that you know you have uh, more frequent you know earthquakes. Now, in terms of other hazards, uh, the storms. That's an interesting uh, topic because there are quite a lot of storms. Practically, the storms that form in the in the um, in the Black Sea move from uh, um, from west to east because they are actually you know like um, they are probably, you know the same system you know that develops also you know along the Mediterranean. But they can be uh, they, they have been you know historically you know some really bad storms. There was one that actually you know caused you know uh, some you know to sink you know during the uh, Crimean War. There, there have been several that actually, you know, um, have destroyed, you know, facilities, you know, so places like Yalta or places like Sevastopol even have had problems, you know, with that. Recently, you know, a few years ago, you know, there was one that actually even damaged um, the jetties and, you know, some structures, you know, in Sevastopol. These are storms that, you know, come from the from the west, and once, you know, they get, you know, over the... Um, uh, the Black Sea, which is, you know, a relatively warm, relatively warm waters, you know, they actually power, you know, like really bad winds and not probably, you know, like a tropical hurricane, but, you know, with a lot of damage, particularly, you know, the waves that they, they cause. I um, remember also, you know, when I was working there in the late 90s, a uh, ship that actually sank, you know, with uh, passengers traveling, you know, from... Um, from Simferopol, no, from Sevastopol to Istanbul. Uh, 